towering over her Maryland Avenue home in Westbrook, Janice LaFlame remembers that day long ago when this fir tree was planted. One of my kids brought it home from school 30 plus years ago on Arbor Day, and it was nothing more than a little sapling. And it's been mowed over a few times and keeps coming back. Now she says it's just too big. She worries it might damage her neighbor's home. So she and her husband decided why not donate it to the city of Portland to be used as its annual holiday tree. She found out just today her tree was selected above all of the applicants. So are you surprised? Very. Two, one, Merry Christmas! When your tree is chosen, there comes with it a few perks, including six free tickets to the Rick Charette and the Bubblegum Band concert. My grandchildren will love that. Um, a free overnight at the Holiday Inn. She'll miss the memories. When the kids brought it home, they were so excited to plant it and everything. And hearing my husband grumble saying, you know, we're going to have to cut that down in 30 years, you know. <laughs> so um, here we know, are. Here we are 30 plus years later and it's coming down. Are you going to plant something else I there? I am not. <laughs> <laughs> Thursday morning, 8 a.m., the tree's coming down. They'll have to negotiate those power lines there. And then it'll make its dramatic six mile pilgrimage from Westbrook to Monument Square where it'll be decorated, but the big tree lighting won't happen until the Friday after Thanksgiving. In Westbrook, Jim Keithley, WMTW News 8.